Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, gentlemen, wherever you are on this rock. Captain Pizzazz here, just uh, playing around with the Sabi Wabi. But uh, yeah, it's turning into a real project for sure, just to get at this uh, timing system in the car. I'll turn the camera around and let you guys check it out. So be right back. All right, guys, here's where we're at. Battery tray, engine mounts removed, left the turbo and the exhaust in, everything on this side of the engine, power steering, water pump, and a bolt, oops, a bolt or two out of the uh, air conditioning are out. Uh, all the ancillary components that go on the front of the engine, oops, let me re-aim the camera here. <coughs> that block of wood, I need to trim down and get it in between the engine. Everything on the back is sort of kind of out. I still am working on that. Need to get that out before we get to getting the cover off. Underneath the engine. Uh, let me find a good spot. Uh, you can't really see. I put all the caps back on. Let me get underneath here. Alrighty. So here we are. I don't know if you can see. There's a cap or two there near the uh, crank sensor wheel. We put all the caps back on so when we do our top dead center for the timing, all that goodiness, it's in the right, we can do it in the right spot, not bend valves, all that good stuff. <coughs> Over here, we got a uh, a jack holding up the trans which keeps sinking we got another jack right here holding up the engine up here we got a block of wood that we're pressing against and then that block of wood on the top of the engine that you just saw we got to trim that down so it'll fit between the engine mount and the cylinder head so it holds it out so then we can get that cover off so a few other little things holy holy shit this is in depth. I should have just, if I keep taking parts off, I should have just took it out of the car. So, I don't know, I might be able to take it out through the top, still do that. So, it'd be much easier at this point, I think. So, there might be a few other bolts, a few other little things I gotta take out, but other than that, it's hard to say it right now, but car love guys talk to you later stay safe out there all right guys captain pizzazz here got a new cameraman look i'm hands free now don't need to do the do the camera thing uh we'll we'll introduce our cameraman a little different episode maybe in one of our MGTOW videos which probably when that'll happen so we got another one coming up uh, i don't know i gotta finish the the outline or the script for it and then we can get on with that and there'll be another big top video out there for you guys i don't want to really give it away but you know it's it, i'm hoping it'll be interesting and helpful for all of you anyway so if you want to zoom in here look down here like i showed in the last video we got this mallet shaft right here here's an idler wheel so we're going to try and get that out without having to cut it but we do have the uh uh Air tool ready. Let me get in there in the dirtiness. In the dirtiness. There we go. It's nice to have to be able to work with both your hands and not have to record. Of course, this is going to be a bear fighting me, so we might have to just go with the air tool and make it quick and painless. Maybe. We shall see. Yeah. We'll go with the air tool. All right, guys, it's going to get noisy. We'll get her knocked out of here. Let's we'll see what we can get out of here. Uh, let's see, best angle of attack here. Yeah, she leaks a little. I got to fix my air fitting. Maybe on top. Yeah, we'll try on top.
That might have got her. Let's see. Oh, not quite yet. I know I'm cutting into that idler wheel, guys, but we're not going to use it. We're not replacing it. So. That's got to zing zing. And if you guys are worried about all the little sparks and all the little metal bits that went into the engine or down in the there, we're going to use brake clean and all that stuff, clean this way up before we do it back together, put it all back together. One evil balance chain out. That was the noise all the way back from Texas. Done. So... That's the garbage we're taking out. We're not even gonna replace it. Um, looks like some of the, besides where I cut, looks like some of these teeth, that's probably where all the metal goo is coming from. That's the balance shaft right there. She's got a little bit of wobble too, but that's all right, because we're not using it again. Idler wheel. What's over here? Oh, that's a directly to the balance shaft. There's no idler on this side. But that's pretty much got it, guys. That's pretty much got it, guys. That's the last thing I wanted to do today. And uh, we're going to call her a night. Maybe have a beer or something, whatever. That sounds like a decent plan. And uh, we'll catch back up. Oh, lost the glove. Was trying to save it. Running out of them. But, uh, yeah, we'll try and catch back up with it tomorrow. And, uh... I guess, as you know, car love guys, stay safe out there. Oh, one final note, guys. Forgot to tell you, timing chain and all that jazz for all that and all the tensioners and everything looks great. So don't have to spend that hundred some dollars, hopefully, on that. Should last, hopefully, for a good long time. Hopefully. We're trying to, like I said, budget build this one. So wish it luck. And as always, car love. See you later, guys.